Coming up, we take a look at a low impact fitness routine that will build muscle and burn fat. Welcome back to Great Day Washington. Well, as we continue to explore the best ways to be the best you in 2019, we turn to one of the safest and most time efficient resistance training workouts ever. It's called Slow Burn. And joining us now is the founder, Frederick Hahn. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you very much. Okay, Thank so you. Slow Burn, what is it? So Slow Burn is a, is a way of strength training using very slow and controlled movements. I, I kind of tell my clients it's like the Tai Chi of strength training. Okay. And the reason for that is so that you make, number one, you make the exercises as safe as possible. And by moving very, very slowly, you're asking your muscles to do all of the work all of the time. And so you say that you're not sweating and jumping up and down. You're dressed in a very casual clothes, cowboy boots here. Right. But many people think, including myself, you have to jump up and down and sweat to burn. Right. No, actually, um, when you're working very, very slowly, because you're not allowing momentum to do a lot of the work or gravity to do the work, because you're asking your muscles to do all the work all the time, it's a much safer and far more metabolically effective exercise. Because you say... You know, people think they got to get all that to burn the fat, but mm -hmm. it's really the, what we're putting in our body That's right. and then we have to do to our body to make it healthy. That's right. That's a very important point. Most people believe, and this is a very, very important talking point, exercise does very little, if anything, to burn body fat. When you exercise vigorously, that's a good thing. You get good physical benefit right. from it. But the energy that your body's using during that time of activity is almost exclusively sugar from within your muscles, not fat within your fat cells. Well, the good thing about your book, I'd love for you to tell us more, is that you have recipes on what to eat, mm -hmm. you have photos on how to work out, mm -hmm. and information about how to just live a total inside and out better life. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, well, uh, we tried I very hard. I fold it for you here. What else can you tell <laughs> There you go. <laughs> <Right> out. <laughs> yeah, so that combination between eating healthfully, keeping the sugar in your diet to a bare minimum, keeping your protein adequate, and strength training as little as twice a week at the most. Because the well, benefits of exercise, we talk about this in the book, the benefits of exercise come, no matter what exercise it is, come when you're resting from the exercise, not mm. when you're exercising itself. So recovery is very important. All right, can you show us some exercises? Sure, love okay. to. Okay. Right. We're hearing my, a right. lot about recovery take our heels today. Up. I know. Yeah, it's I know. a very I'm important point. I'm starting to think we it's may nice not even need to, yeah. but no, right. you will just be off. reminded <laughs> of the right way to do things. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the very first exercise we're going to do is an exercise to strengthen the glutes and a little bit of the lower back. So this is what we call a slow burn glute kickback. Okay. Now, what you see a lot is people throwing their leg out there. And you don't want to do that because it's forceful and you're going to hurt your back. So the way we do it is like so. You bend your knee slightly, and then very, very slowly, you're going to raise your leg out and up as far as you can, and then squeeze the hips and the glutes and the lower back, and then very, very slowly bring it back down. And without resting, right. keep the tension, keep doing it. slowly bring it back up again, as far as you feel that you can, squeeze as strongly as you can, and then slowly back feel down. Feel that after now, just doing two. <laughs> right? Now, what you, ideally what you do is you do as many of those until you reach complete fatigue, switch to the other side, okay. and then do the other side like that. This Immediately is, after, yeah. I was going to say, this is good. We have time for one more workout. Okay. And if the folks watching at home want to get up out of their seats, maybe mm -hmm. they can do it with us into commercial break. Sure, okay. sure. Okay. So yep. what would you like to show us? So next? the next one will be for the entire lower body. Okay. And you'll put your hand on the chair like so, yep. feet shoulder wide, and then as slowly as you can, sitting up tall, just slowly let your hips come down as far as you feel that you can. What if you don't go down far? What That's that okay, mean? just as far as you can. And then slowly back upward. Now you don't want to go so far up that you lock. Just a little bend in the knee, and then slowly just back down again. Continuous movement. And you just continue it, continuous right. movement. Until you get to the point where maybe you're here and you literally cannot continue to lift your body. And that's what we call reaching momentary muscular success, which works all the muscle fibers. All so right. This is my kind of workout. I know. I, I like this. I can do it. Thank right. you well, so much. You're very welcome. Thanks. The, the Slow Burn Fitness Resolution mm -hmm. is the book. We'll be back with more great day after this.